Yo, what's up? Moki here. Rejoice for tap strafing having survived. Respawn just tweeted that they are not touching tap strafing with the patch that comes with the Evolution Collection event. This is incredibly good news after they announced two weeks ago that they would remove it. After the harsh reaction to that announcement, I, among others, was invited to talk about and test tap strafing with Respawn. Which I'm incredibly thankful for. It's an honor that they trust me in this topic enough to have me on a call like this. I feel we had a very level-headed and insightful talk about tap strafing with them. For now, they decided to not go forward with the intended fix for tap strafing, cause it's affecting other movement tech. For the sake of, I don't know, professionalism, I'd like to not talk about the specifics of what triggered that or what they intend to do in the future, until they decide to communicate more publicly. I suggested a way to handle tap strafing, which I think falls perfectly in line with what their actual goals are, but we just have to wait and see what they eventually do. Though I am hopeful for a future where tap strafing still has a place within Apex, while just its most extreme use cases got brought under control in a way that feels fair and justified. So tap strafe away and enjoy the freedom you still have. I wanna see those Rampart mobile turret jump pad tap strafes tomorrow. I will likely stream after the patch for the Evolution Collection event drops tomorrow, so come and vibe with us. Thanks so much for watching, long live tap strafing and I will see you in the next video. Bye!